Hello and welcome to Herald TV News Bulletin with me, Conal Rosario. The Old Goa protest against the illegal structure in the Heritage Zone has completed 100 days on Thursday. The hearing before the Directorate of Panchayats will take place on Friday. The Save Old Goa Action Committee has filed a caveat before the High Court, a case before the Directorate of Panchayat, and the case is also before the Supreme Court. Save Old Goa committee has filed a caveat in the High Court which has not yet been uh, approved at least from what I know but also in the Director of Panchayats. That's how we got a notice that this hearing is happening tomorrow. So Save Old Goa committee will be, re will be represented by an advocate tomorrow also there. To, but till now we have not even received the, uh, the, uh, the plea of the builder as to what grounds he is seeking to or scrap the demolition order. So once we receive that, our advocate will study it, we will all study it, then we can know. But tomorrow your advocate will be present? He will be hearing. there. He will, de he will be there and he will ask for the uh, all of their grounds that they are claiming to scrap. Our case is also going on in the Supreme Court uh, and that's like, I mean, we've recently also discovered that there is a precedent for this. In 2019, the Supreme Court of India passed a case very similar, also played around by a Gujarati builder who was working in Delhi, some Dhawal constructions. They had, uh, outside Jantar Mantar, they had taken permission to repair a building, a ground and one floor old Haveli. They built a ground and four floor building. So, I mean, our Supreme Court case is also going strong. But when the state government is now slowly starting to move, we don't want them to stop. Because you never know when a Supreme Court case can get decided. We are very confident that eventually we will have victory in the Supreme Court. But until that time, uh, a lot of damage is being done to the heritage site every day. The village panchayat of Old Goa will defend the demolition order at that hearing. Uh, the builders have hired one of Bombay's biggest advocates to defend them. It's obvious that they have a lot of money on their side, which we know who they are also. So, it's very, very important that you as the press, fourth pillar of democracy, are there tomorrow at 12 noon at Junta House to catch hold of the panchayat, the panchayat's advocate, and if possible, even take a statement from the builders as to what, what grounds they have to appeal the demolition. Story by Devendra Gaunkar for Herald TV. In a bizarre incident reported at Talponwada in Shiroda, which sends shock waves across the state on Wednesday, a bachelor allegedly bludgeoned his father to death with an iron rod for not getting him a marriage proposal. Second such incident of a child taking the life of a parent. Son kills father for not getting him a marriage proposal. The accused 34-year-old Rajesh Ganesh Gaunkar allegedly murdered his father Ganesh Raghobha Gaunkar with an iron rod and a floor tile. Ponda Police has registered an offence under Section 302. According to Ponda Police, there was an altercation between the father and the son on a marriage proposal issue. Rajesh accused his father of not getting him any marriage proposal and later, in a fit of anger, he assaulted his father on the head with an iron rod. Rajesh further assaulted Ganesh with a floor tile on his head, causing serious injuries. The victim was shifted to Hospicio Margao and later to Goa Medical College and Hospital Bamboli where he succumbed to his injuries. Kalik complaint lodge three three not two murder case chi. Aja case Rajesh Gaukar or Chauti Sotsuburgo, then Apla Bapa to sixty five year old Ganesh Gaukar, Echer Paray Marli to Kletcher, and it don't do GMC expired. Aja Badlan Karan Mulla. The Jami evidence is collected that the Janagata Gito, Bapai Gadis Gudigar Tatal, Aple, Lernakur, and Aplan Surigatan. I mean, Kal Dene, Yatskarna Villan, Zurigatli, and Bapai, the Raja Bayer was murdered. In a Babi Bayer was a Muslim, the Lichet, and a Patlan and the name Wargi. 
आणि तिथून तो एक्सपायर्ड झाला सो आम्ही एकी जर अरेस्ट केला आणि पुढलं इन्व्हेस्टिगेशन चालू रिमांड मारलं सर रिमांड आयज पुढेच करतो ते सो फॅमिली बॅकग्राऊंड कसं येतं गेलं कोण आणि फॅमिली बॅकग्राऊंड म्हटलं त्याका एक बहीण आहा ती विडो आहा ती तिचे घर थंय लागीच तीच हांका दोघा पळताली जेवण बेगीन दिवप रांदप बी तीच करता स्टोरी बाय संजय नाईक फॉर हेराल टीव्ही The coal dump that was dumped at the Verna railway station has been cleared. Team Herald TV visited the site on to check on the reality behind the dump as per sources. The coal was dumped by a third party who was transporting the coal from Amona to Jharkhand. The coal was offloaded at Verna so that it was directly loaded in trucks and the truck would then be loaded in a wagon. Here's the full story. Illegal coal dump cleared after locals and concerned authorities pressure. On Tuesday villages of Nagwa Verna opposed stacking of coal by a nearby mining firm near the Nagwa Verna railway station The villagers along with local authorities stopped another 30 trucks from stacking ore in the vicinity First of uh, this March. month hmm. I was informed by some villagers and the ex sarpanch of our village that there was some coal being offloaded from trucks for transportation to Jharkhand and he asked me just to come there to support them to see that this activity is stopped so i went there and i realized uh, that there were about 30 or 40 trucks that come had come and there was a jcb of loading the coal from the trucks into the uh, yard in the konkan railway uh, station in uh, verna so our mla was there our uh, panch was there our village development committee uh, chairman hanzil gudino was there so we tried to immediately inform the authorities and as soon as we we managed to contact the sdm mr bolwaikar and uh, pi daigo who came there immediately and instructed that these trucks which had come to offload the coal should be removed because they did not have any permissions from the local authorities and from the pollution control board to do the handling of the cargo at the konkan railway station subsequent to that uh, uh, the deputy collector and stm he spoke to uh, mr joglekar over the phone asking him to send some people for a uh, verification about this uh, permission and so on and so forth whether they were given to this authorities to handle uh, coal in bulk and there they was informed that no such permission was given for them to handle the coal in bulk okay. story by clinton the souza for herald tv there are nearly total of 19 goan students in ukraine from which six have reached back to goa herald tv spoke to these heroes who returned back to goa safely from the war all they said is that we want peace and not war we went to study for a better future but unfortunately we had to return back as refugees of the total 19 goan students in ukraine seven have arrived in goa one will arrive on saturday two students are in kharkiv and are moving towards the border one student is in sumi and moving towards the border three more students are also moving towards the border so i feel very blessed because um, i was actually spiritually connected to god so that has helped me a lot in my journey till i reached home and even after and before and also when i came home the first thing i felt when i stepped inside was thank god i reached home before anything happened So I was very happy I was feeling blessed I was feeling re- relieved that I saw my parents my parents could see me in a in a safe happy way like you know there was not much tension as of now so yeah I was I was very relieved so when we were deciding to leave uh, there was news that the russian army they are all coming to the border of ukraine and the situation was entirely tense people people were hardly coming out of their houses and all they were stocking everything inside like food groceries and all you know but then what happened was uh, the news came out that the russian troops are going back so everybody was like okay fine there might not be war 
maybe we should not go home so people stayed back but then we thought like we don't know even if they're going back if they've decided for war then why would they go back what if they come back again or like all of a sudden then we'll all fall in trouble no so still we decided even if the troops are going back doesn't matter we'll go home because that's where we feel most safe and this all started in early january the rumors about putin building up troops around the borders of ukraine and there was like reports of shelling in the border states like donetsk and luhansk and so it all started with that and then after that we were not really bothered because we thought like okay so the border they won't affect us because we don't say i was far away from the borders so we were like ha- we were safe we at least we thought we were safe then um, our university kept telling us that nothing would happen our teachers kept telling us nothing would happen it was just rumors and nothing would actually happen but then like people still panic some indians panic and they went back home immediately they paid a lot of money for the flights and they went back home then the mbc started issuing notices saying that if your stay is not essential you can go back but at that time we were still confused we have a licensing exam coming up in june so we were not sure about whether we should go back how it would affect our exam how it would affect our studies लास्ट एट डेज मीटिंग आसले कशी सिचुएशन आसले इन युक्रेन मार्कूस गॉन्सालवेस एंड क्लिंटन डिसूजा फॉर हेराल्ड टीवी Domestic flights have picked up very well and after the Omicron wave during the pandemic there were currently around 40 departures and currently they are handling about 80 departures per day the airport director has said Oman and Qatar have booked their slots with the government of India they believe that by the end of the march scheduled operations are expected to start One charter flight arrived from Russia Thursday morning where over 506 passengers arrived 489 passengers have departed and Russia has not cancelled any slot so far. Every 9th or 10th day one flight comes from Russia and so far they have operated seven slots. Flights from Kazakhstan too are continuing. Domestic tourism has picked up very well and uh, I must say that ki whole through this pandemic uh, the contribution of domestic tourism has been wonderful as far as Goa state is concerned. <coughs> yesterday <coughs> night up till 12 um, there were 82 departures aur usme aur 82 ye arrivals the scheduled arrivals domestic ke aur usme more than 12000 passengers aaye hain more than 13000 passengers gaye hain to ye basically <coughs> sequential hai depend karta hai kis tarah ke weekends hain kis tarah ke weekdays hain लीव्स के कैसे सिनेरियो हैं जो उसकी वीक में फ्रीक्वेंसी थी दो फ्लाइट्स की लंदन की दे हैव रिक्वेस्टेड अ स्लॉट टू अस फॉर इंक्रीजिंग वन मोर फ्लाइट इन अ वीक तो यानी कि लंदन के लिए यहाँ से तीन फ्लाइट हो जाएंगी वी आर लुकिंग इन टू दी स्लॉट इन स्लॉट टाइमिंग तो बेसिकली ये दर्शाता है कि हम वापस नॉर्मल सी की तरफ बढ़ रहे हैं धीरे धीरे थैंक यू सर Opposition leader Digambar Kamat called on them not to do the panchayat ward delimitation hurriedly and leave the process to the next government. The Congress has alleged that the BJP Goa has hired an agency to tap mobile phones of their leaders. They want the BJP not to invade their privacy. Congress also denied rumors that they are divided before the election results. Congress will form the next government in Goa, says Michael Lobo.
ज्या पद्धतीन ते वतात ती पद्धत पळत जाल्यार सगळ्या पंचायतीचे ऑब्जेक्शन आहा मायकल सांगतालो ताजे पंचायतीचे आसा मोरेन सांगतालो ताजे पंचायतीचे आसा ते फक्त किदें नंबर चेंज करता वार्ड नंबर चेंज करता परत त्या पयलीच्याच गणीत करपाक सोदता म्हणजे स्टेट इलेक्शन कमिशनाक हे सगळे डिलिमिटेशन प्रोसेस हँड ओव्हर करपाच्या फाटल्यान रिजर्वेशनाचो प्रोसेस हँड ओव्हर करपा फाटल्यान एक हेतू आशिल्लो याद करात म्युनसिपालिटीच्या इलेक्शनाच्या वेळार कितें जाल्ले ते फक्त चार तारखे ह्या बोवाळांत सगळे बोवाळांत आसना चार तारखे भितर तशे ऑब्जेक्शन घालपाक जायना सो दीस डेट शूड बी फर्दर पोस्टपोन आनी तांणी प्रोसेस कसो करपो ती क्लेरिटी हाडपाक जाय किदें करपा जाय बेश्टा नंबर चेंज कर आपल्या जाय ते परत सरकाराक जाय त्याच भशेन जातले म्हणून म्हणजे विनंती आसा स्टेट इलेक्शन कमिशनरा की इमिजिएटली हो प्रोसेस स्टॉल करचो टायम वाडोवचो आनी प्रोसेस कशे पद्धतीन करपाक सोदता ताजेर क्लेरिटी दिवची रिजल्ट भायर सरच्या पयलीच रुमर्स स्प्रेड जाता की आमदार फुटल्या म्हणून आमदार जावंक ना अजूनी आमदार अजूनी जावंक ना आनी कोण हो रुमर स्प्रेड करता ते गोयकारांक खबर आहा आणि गोयकारान जी सोशल मिडियाचेर जी गजाली वयता स्प्रेड जाता थ्रू वॉट्सॲप सोशल मिडिया ग्रुप्स फेसबुक इंस्टाग्राम ट्विटर हेचेर बली पड पडचे न्हू डू नॉट गो एज पर वॉट कम्स ऑन दॅट फेसबुक ऑर ऑन सोशल मिडिया दीज आर नॉट ट्रू अँड आय वॉन्ट टू टेल ऑल द गोवन्स दॅट ह्या पावटी जे काँग्रेसान उमेदवार दिल्ले आहा आणि आमदार जाऊन येतले ते कोणूच फुटचे ना आम्ही स्थिर गव्हर्मेंट दितले वी विल गिव्ह अ गुड गव्हर्मेंट बाय थ्री अ क्लॉक आय थिंक द रिझल्ट विल बी आउट बाय फायव्ह अ क्लॉक वी विल स्टे क्लेम टू फॉर्म द नेक्स्ट गव्हर्मेंट काँग्रेस पार्टी विल स्टे क्लेम टू फॉर्म द नेक्स्ट गव्हर्मेंट The Monmugao Municipal Council employees have decided to go on a strike if their two months pending salaries are not cleared by Monday. The MMC have decided to divert development funds to pay the salaries of the sanitation staff. The sanitation staff's salary should be paid first since they clean the city, a union leader has said. The government has taken away the octroi collection from the municipality. If we get the octroi from the government, we don't have to ask them for any other funds mormagaon municipal council employees threaten to go on strike if salary is not paid by monday mmc has decided to divert development funds to pay the salaries of the sanitation staff the government has taken away the octroi collection from the municipality if we get the octroi from government we don't have to ask them for any other funds urban secretary or village secretary at the office of the state we can the local guy put in here हे आमगेले गार्बेज वर्कर आहा आणि ते झाडवाले पे आणि शहर साफ दोवरपाचे काम हे लोक करतात तर म्हणल्यार सरकारान आमक पयली दिवपाचे कित्याक हे निवळ काळ केले शिवाय काय मेळ जायना पण आज तांच्यानी किती केला तांचे डेव्हलपमेंटाचो ग्रांट आसा थंय तो ऑलरेडी ग्रांट हे करपो डायवर्ट करपे हे केला डी एम एन फायल मू हे करून ती सेक्रेटरी गेली कोण लागली लागल्या कारणान ती अर्बन सेक्रेटरी होती अर्बन सेक्रेटरी तारीख थॉमस म्हणजे तो आज हा सांगचे येतो बाय सांचो म्हणल्यार तुम्ही क्लिअर करता आणि बाय मंडे म्हणल्यार तुम्ही पेमेंट घालतून सांगा तरी असं आम्ही हे ओगी रावचो ना किद्याक वास्को तोडप पगाराचो इश्यू सदांचो जावन पडला सो आम्ही मेन एक किती केलं आम्ही युनियनाक ऑल ओव्हर गोवा जो ऑफकॉय टॅक्स आहा जो पेट्रोल पंपाचे टॅक्स येता तो एक्सक्लुजली टॅक्स म्हणजे तो म्युन्सिपालिटीचो त्या त्या तो सरकारान व्हेलो की मागीर तुमकां तो दितले म्हणजे थोडे दीस दिले आणि मागीर ते दिवपाचे बंद जाले तो ऑफकॉय तर तर आमकां मेळो जाय आणि आमकां पगाराचो प्रॉब्लेम नाच सो आम्ही सगळ्या म्युन्सिपालिटीक ती लेटर दिल्या तुम्ही रेजिस्ट्रेशन घ्या म्हणला आणि त्या इश्यूचेर आम्ही ऑल गोवाचे इश्यू घेऊन सांगा आर्श करू समर्थ समर्थ जाल्यार आम्ही स्ट्रायकर इश्यू करतात बँक लोन तो त्या बँक लोन त्या तांचं तांच लोकल ते कसे दितले ते आमकां कोण गेले आमचे लोकांक पुरसो आमचे पगार जो दोन महिने म्हणल्यार खूप झाले पगार किती पयशे ना तांच्या काढटलो जाल्यार ते नावार करतलो जाल्यार आमकां एकट्याच प्रमाणे वयता सो एक्ट जेन्ना एमेंडमेंट जातलो तेन्ना आमकां ते सगळे स्वतंत्र सॉटआउट जातले हांगा आमकां रेंट मेळना रेंट सुद्धा आमी कोर्टाचे येता सो सगळो इश्यू आहा एक्ट एमेंडमेंट जालो की म्हाका सगळे स्वतंत्र जातले केन्ना केन्ना बंद आसा आयज आयज म्हाका दिसता एक पांच वर्सां जाली ऑक्टोबर सेवेंटीनानसून ऑक्टोबर बंद जाले आसा 
आज अन सर दे मुनसिपाल्टी जे वर्कर्स युनियन लीडर ये आसला रिगार्डिंग पेमेंट वर्कर्स पेमेंट जाऊना मुंका तर्फे आश्वासन दिल्ली कि बाय नेक्स्ट वीक पेमेंट क्लियर कर ना आश्वासन दिला मेन दिल्ली मेन मेनला आसो ये दोन महीन तो पेमेंट उल्ला तो फर्स्ट प्रिफरन्स मेला तो पेमेंट क्लियर कर विचार किया फुड़ वसन ये अच्छे चालू उल्ले जाए ना परत पर प्रॉब्लम क्रिएट जो तेन सी एम ची एपॉइंटमेंट घाक डिस्कशन कर कि बाबा हेर कि पर्मनंट सोल्यूशन मेपा तेन ते एपॉइंटमेंट घाने आज ना जो फाला दिता मंटला पर्मनंट सोल्यूशन पे ऑक्ट्रा जी एस टी लगे कारण ऑक्ट्रा एबॉलिश जला तं गमेंटान इन द फॉर्म्स ऑफ स्पेशल ग्रांट दिता मनु सुधा फॉर्म ऑफ स्पेशल ग्रांट सुधा दिल्ली एक तीन चार इंस्टॉलमेंट सुधा दिल्ली हम मे आका पेमेंटा सपोर्ट जो पेमेंट कंटिन्ुअसली दिवक शकता किरण बोरकर फॉर हेराल टीवी Illegal hill cutting is taking place at Lotolim in Goa near the Missing Link Road along the newly constructed Verna Ponda Highway. While police control van personnel came to inspect the site on Wednesday, the people were waiting for the flying squad. Police inspector Mohan Gaude of Maina Kotorim however said the flying squad would come to the site on Thursday morning. Illegal hill cutting taking place at Lotolim Police control van personnel came to inspect the site on Wednesday. The flying squad would come Thursday morning. Police said. We have called Hilkani Gotal. The contractor has called. They have missed. 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 टोटली सरपंच संगता तक संग हुई पाम बंद करें नोस्मो नो ऑथरिटीज केम डाउन ओवर हियर टू चेक ऑल दिस थिंग्स सेम थिंग फ्लाइंग स्क्वाड कोई कॉल किया लामी लाइक अबाउट लाइक 5:30 फ्लाइंग स्क्वाड कॉल किया लोले फ्लाइंग स्क्वाड डिड नॉट इवन टर्न अप टिल लेट इवनिंग इवनिंग 8:00 वी हियर टुडे दे आर कम हियर नाउ एट 12:00 10:30 10:30 वाज द टाइमिंग गिवन टू अस बट ना आता ते 12 होना चाहिए आते ले एले चोले रिपोर्ट गेले ते रिपोर्ट मुकार कोतले मडे आता वी वांट टू सी व्हाट एक्शन दे आर गोइंग टू टेक बिकॉज़ दिस इलीगलिटीज कैन नॉट हैपन जस्ट लाइक दैट आज तो रेस को ये तो अपना जाए दूंगा का तो तो लंका बार तो जैसे हाल उलान कि सो तंग रूल्स एंड रेगुलेशन लगना है हंगे प्रोसिजर्स लगना है फाइल कंप्लीट विद पुलिस या वी कॉल्ड एस्टरडे जेना पर पुलिस आएगा पुलिस ने सैंस आई पड़ जाए ना फ्लाइंग स्पॉट ये ना ना मूँ पुलिस घेन तंग पुलिस स्टेशन से गले पुलिस स्टेशन से फोर फाइल किया मिशनरीज पड़े हाई तीस फोर तंक सील सीज के मुझे तंक डॉक्यूमेंट गले तंक चाई गले पुलिस अपना दो हाई तो बट दे वे वेटिंग फॉर द फ्लाइंग स्पॉट टू कम टुडे मॉर्निंग आज सकाळी पाते थैंक यू रावताले सगुन गावडे फॉर हेराल टीवी सेवरल लोकल्स फ्रॉम खांदुलिम हैव रेज्ड देयर वॉइस ओवर द रैंपेंट इलीगलिटीज गोइंग ऑन एट द खांदुलिम बीच लोकल्स हैव आल्सो स्ट्रांगली ऑब्जेक्टेड टू डिस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ बीच वेजिटेशन इन द सीआरजी एरिया एट खांदुलिम द एनजीओ खलांगुड फोरम हैज फाइल्ड अ कंप्लेंट for destroying beach vegetation in the CRZ area and destruction of sand dunes at Kandolim but even after filing a complaint no authority has taken any steps to stop this destruction Kandolim locals demand immediate action on illegalities at Kandolim beach beach vegetation sand dunes destroyed by private owners locals file complaint with NGT and concerned authorities Locals have also said that even after filing a complaint, no authority have taken any steps to stop this destruction. Forum change and zone as well, environment and the coastal area protection are chair work. Today, I am going to tell you that if there is a certain area, a wild area, a limb or so, it is destroyed, then it is kapun kapun. Sir, the thought is wrong. Last week, I have seen in Kalangut Zalali, I have seen in the High Court and Soho Moto, and the department of the competent authorities have been told that there are many incidents in the country, so that there are many incidents in the country, and 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 there are the first line of defense, in case there is a tsunami, 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 लोकल जे आसा गांवकार जे आसा तेंच्यानी विजिल रावपाची गरज आसा 
की असली एक्टिविटीज बंद कर गरज आता क्या इट इज अ थ्रेट टू दियर ओन लाइफ हा पे खूब कंप्लेनी घून जो हि एक कंप्लेन आता जैसे फोटो लाइन घी आता सी आर जेड फोर टुवेल्व ट्वेंटीन घी कंप्लेनी तेजेर आज पास कहीं एक्शन जाऊना जेसीबी घूमने बे फोटो लाइन कंप्लेन घी आता जेसीबीन तेल के हंगा सगे तेजेर तो अजुन पास एक्शन जाल आज इतने फुढ़े पाते ना आसले सारे ये हमें नेचर सारे डिस्ट्रॉय के रे काम करता पेपरार फोरम एक्शन घर सक कंप्लेनी तरी सु काम चालू दौर सटिंग दौरिया संग पांच मीटर पास दौरी ना ये पोल आ दौर पा तिगा रे चार चार मीटर पांच पांच मीटर ये कतरुन 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 आता पे सेंड ड्यून सेंड ड्यून आशी पाला जो तो एक वही वसाड़ी वहीं काबार को ये भाषे हम मगता कि पंच हुई निर्मे सरपंच हुई नि ये पोपा तुम चो कहो नीका बस पंचायती गांव राखपा तो गांव राखलो राखले स्टोरी बाय प्रकाश गडेकर फॉर हेराल टीवी The Kalangut police have raided a slaughter house located in front of a retreat center at Goravaro in Kalangut. The owner Antonio Fernandez was accused of slaughtering animals and selling beef illegally. The complainant Wilfred Pereira said skulls of cattle and containers containing animal fats was found. The owner Antonio Fernandez retaliated saying there was no slaughtering that has been happening there for the last 10 years. Police raided a slaughter house in Goravaro Kalangut. Animal Husbandry Department received letters of complaint against owner Antonio Fernandez. Wilfred Pereira accused the owner of catching stray cows and slaughtering them. Antonio Fernandez denied that any slaughtering had taken place there for the last 10 years. Skulls of cattle are there and also there is a lot of many containers containing the animal fats which looks to be a very big interstate racket. of cattle slaughter this needs to be investigated by the police and the other media i i asked the authorities to take a strict action against this so there is even fresh uh, skulls there mm -hmm. like in that room one room in the left there was that is very fresh okay the slaughtering is going on and it's going on and it's also taking place in these jungles only mm -hmm. the cattle are being stray cattle are being robbed and they are being like it is they are tied in the field and all they, they are taken they are slaughtered they are tied under a tree completely the meat is removed everything and they are sold oh, okay. and there it's a nexus of very big people which has to be investigated ame no ka aaj to kon da yan kon ye log wilfred pereira ramon and police ang and doctor ik ganela veterinary cha and sangta ang to lukde korun da koi amche daraje lock modla and room sagle ute korun pailya मेल्ट कर फॉलोअर्स ऑन ओ हेराल्डो ऑन फेसबुक एंड ट्विटर टेक केयर एंड गुड बाय